It's been two years since five-year-old Austin Wingo died after drowning in a swimming pool at the YMCA in Pulaski. Now, his family is filing a $20 million lawsuit against the Y. 10 News reporter Thomas Mundy breaks down the lawsuit and the details surrounding this tragedy. The lawsuit filed this week states that Austin Wingo was attending a daycare at the YMCA in December of 2021 when the five-year-old was found face down underwater in the YMCA swimming pool before dying at a hospital hours later. According to court documents, Austin was one of at least 38 children between the ages of 5 and 10 at the pool during a virtual learning day. Four YMCA employees were tasked with watching over the children. The initial investigation determined there was no evidence of criminal negligence. Now the family of Wingo is suing the YMCA for $20 million for compensatory and punitive damages. In the lawsuit, it states at the time of the incident, there was only one lifeguard on duty to watch over almost 40 children. It also states the three child care workers were not stationed correctly around the pool. The lawsuit alleges once Wingo was discovered, CPR was not performed and an AED was not readily available. Wingo was pronounced dead later that evening at Lewis Gale Hospital in Pulaski. We reached out to the YMCA of Pulaski and we received a statement reading, the YMCA of Pulaski County staff and volunteers were devastated when Austin Wingo passed away. The Y takes all allegations of misdoing very seriously and are fully cooperating in all facets of the legal process. We also reached out to the legal team of Wingo and they said though they know how important recreational centers can be to the communities with the dangerous circumstances that led to Wingo's death, someone needs to be held accountable. Reporting in Pulaski County, I'm Thomas Mundy, 10 News, working for you.